come back from the future. To answer your question past me, no, you really haven't done any more protests like the one that you did yesterday. But I'd like to think that the one that you did do caused at least a small impact with the development of the Keystone Pipeline. As I'm saying this to you, a week from now, a week or so, uh, Congress is going to vote on the Keystone Pipeline Bill. And it, there's been many changes since you went to the protest. The, uh, the House of Representatives approved the bill this previous January, but the Senate tweaked it a little bit and added some amendments, one of which actually acknowledged climate change as real and not just a hoax, which is, that's, that's a big step forward. So now, about a week from now, the bill is going back to the House for approval, and then after that, it'll probably go to the president's desk where he can choose whether he's going to approve it or just quietly make it disappear which would probably be the best option because this pipeline is a terrible idea I'm just gonna go right out and say that I don't think they should pass this and the more I read into it the more that I think that this should not be passed so Also, going to the protests last night, it strengthened your friendships with Zach Tracy and Christy Parsons and some other cool people that you hadn't really talked to much before then. So, that's a positive. That's a positive aspect of, the, uh, of last night.